Passel here, co-host of the Nerdy Man Room Show. We proudly present to you Man Room Shorts. Your discretion is advised. We did get just a little hint. Marvel Legends team has still has still been out doing some rounds, making some more interviews, especially after the whole take away the window in the box thing, and they're still doing more. But uh, one of the things that's come out in one of their recent interviews is they have hinted that there might be another HasLab project from their team that later this year. Um, it's not a surprise given the, the the fact of how well they've sold all their HasLabs. Their Galactus, their Sentinel have sold and tripled in price in some places. Uh, but they said they didn't know 100% that it was going to be this year, if it's going to be next year, but they're saying that they already have one lined up. We just don't know when they're going to do it at this point. Um, I will admit, I, you know, I went for the Galactus. I didn't go for the Sentinel. Um, I only went for the Galactus to build a set with my Fantastic Four figures and stuff. And you know, depending on what they make next, which is I'm curious of what would be next for them, because I'm like, where do you go for, after those two large ones? Do you do a... Yeah. It's easy to say do a Celestia or something, because you just take Galactus and start retooling them, but I don't. I don't think they'll go that route because I don't think they'll get the sales out of that that they would other stuff. One, one that's too easy to do. Two, I think the fans will turn on them for being too yeah. easy to do. So, so what, what is next? Then uh, that's my thing. Is I, I have regrets about not going on Sentinel and especially the Sentinel, and even Galactus. Um, so I'm kind of curious. To the only other alternate route is a is a vehicle. Yeah, that's what I was wondering. Do you do a Quinjet? Do you do the X-Men's Blackbird is more recognizable than the Quinjet? The Fantastic Four, Fantastic Car. Well, I think the Fantastic Car would be a little too underwhelming. If they do a Blackbird, though, son of a bitch. Take my money now. I got to think they'll go somewhere else, though, because they've already done X-Men and Fantastic Four. So where else do you draw from, from the you know properties that you have? Well, Quidditch it would probably be easier, honestly, because if you look, it is a little more scaled down and not as sleek or you know stretched out as a. Yeah. Lab. But do you make it in? If you make it in scale to fit a legend or two, and and it may just be a deal where you can fit two legends in or something like that. Do you go the Spider-Man route and do a Daily Bugle building as a playset? That would be an interesting one. Monster, are you, is that why you haven't been able to record? Are you secretly working with Haslabs? <laughs> no, I wish I was. It'd probably be, <laughs> probably be. I, 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 while I like and I enjoy my job a lot, I, I can never really complain about it. I would say that working it for a toy company and designing toys and stuff, not that I could design and draw, but look, just the ideas of stuff of doing toys does sound like a dream job for me. So I don't think I'll ever have it, but hey, it sounds nice. You wouldn't wake up dreading going to work, I promise. Yeah, and I, and I don't now, except for the days that I have to travel, and it's not the actual going to somewhere to travel, it's just the actual execution of traveling. <laughs> Get, getting to the that airport. Or, interacting with other people. Yeah, getting to the airport, getting through security, getting my bag checked, or getting in the car and driving six, seven hours. That, that's that's the part that's dreadful. 